she's hot, but I'm too hot. 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 Hey guys, it's Monty and these are my um, Jack in the Box inspired nails. Honestly, I just officially looked at the Jack in the Box face and I wasn't exactly on par with it. But let me just talk you guys through my thought process. So first, um, this nail adhesive is also like a nail gel glue, so I was really excited to use it. It's not bad. At first, I put too much adhesive and then I was trying to get the circular face that um, Hobie uses for the Jack in the Box face, but it was not working. I was sliding almost everywhere, <laughs> like everywhere, like as you guys can see, like it's not even trying to get into that circular form. So I ended up taking everything off, like it was not working, and then I decided to then just do the eyes, and I realized I did like the X eyes when there were more like crosses, so always look at your reference picture. But again, it was already like 2 a.m. in the morning and I, <laughs> my flight for Chicago was at 8 o'clock, so I definitely was not, um, I wasn't definitely uh, paying attention. I was just too tired. I just was going off memory and my memory did not serve me well, so. Uh, I think I think it was pretty cute it was pretty cute I was like look at me and then I used my silver metallic gel for more of like the other designs honestly I was thinking silver a lot of people when I went to Hobie Palooza wore a lot of teals and that magenta color I was like let me be different let me just go with the silver and I was definitely different <laughs> And I decided to put this one as a circle, then put a smiley face with the metal beads. Cause again, kudos to being different. Mm -hmm. So when I was using this silver chrome, at first I was gonna do a French tip cause you guys know how much I love a French tip. And then I was like, ooh, let me try this other trends I see the other girls do. And honestly, it just became me having fun playing with the gel and just like working with the strokes and all that stuff. So yeah, it was fun. This was actually not really Jack in the Box like vibe, but we could say it is. Did the French? Yeah, I had to. Just one of them. Just one. Oh, they're so cute. And this is where I had to go beast mode. Like I couldn't no longer like try to be in frame and all that stuff. I just said, quick, quick, quick! I gotta go because I still was still some stuff I didn't pack. Um, like you know the stuff for the festival, like you know my water bottle and all that stuff. So I just really was like, I gotta be quick! I gotta be quick! Be quicker than that, be quicker. <laughs> but yeah, I made it on my final time and everything. But um, yeah. the top coat I was about to leave I was about to like you know just up and start doing my suitcase stuff and then I looked at the top coat in the corner of my desk and I'm like oh shit I forgot <laughs> but yeah don't forget your top coat guys don't forget the top coat and there you have it my jack-in-the-box inspired nails hope you guys like it as much as I did I'm sorry I wasn't that much in detail but maybe next time <laughs> Maybe next time. And don't forget in oiling and moisturizing your hands. Well, you know, just make sure you put that moisture back in there. Because all that acetone and alcohol, you really want to make sure our, your hands are moisturized. But I'm done talking. Thank you guys so much for watching. Actually, 
I just got this rose oil from I didn't get it actually I always had it in my cupboard or something look at that I just love this little footage I did oh my god it was everything for me all right I'm done talking bye guys thank you so much for watching bye now <laughs>